Okay, we finally burned the image uh, 64 gig on the 128 gig. So that means we have uh, a chance to, uh, I will get a chance to show you how to uh, utilize the the full amount 128. Okay, so let's go ahead and flip this over. Put the SD card in. Now, since I do not have any heat sink or nothing on it, I don't want to run this thing too long because it will overheat. I'm going to unplug this. Well, actually, it doesn't matter because I'm going to plug the network in and also configure the joystick and also the keyboard. So I need a keyboard for the first time connected. I need a keyboard plug in. Okay, so everything is plugged in. The video is plugged in. Video one. So it had to be should be this one, and then uh, this is video O. H HDMI 0 and HDMI 1 and this is the power okay so nothing else is plugged in I did not plug the external hard drive but because it doesn't work with that okay so let's go ahead and turn the power on and hopefully it will boot up because it is Raspberry Pi 4 image by virtual man 64 gigabyte so if this do not work that tell me that I need to return this uh, Raspberry Pi. I mean, I deal with a Raspberry Pi a lot like this, you know, without specialty grounded or nothing. I just handle it like I normally do, and normally doesn't have problems. So if this happen have a, if this happen to have a problem, that would be my first Raspberry Pi that have issue. Okay, so let's go ahead and turn it on. And see what happens. So if it boot up, that tell me that. You cannot just put any images on here and look like it is booting up because I just see a light up there on the top where those are the light for the for the joystick. So let's go over there and look at it. See if, if this work or not. 